Oh, this is the best thing I have tamed in a long time. We are flying, absolutely flying. This is magnificent. What is going on guys? Unite the Clans here, back in Yo Life. And I've got a quiet morning to myself, and I'm going to use it to record some ARC. I'm in my purple armor today, as you can tell. And there is a reason for that. I have finally tamed up a Donnie to join my pack of uh, Teenage Mutant Parasaurs. Uh, Donnie is loaded up with stuff right now, so he's not exactly a good mount. But um, why don't I hop on Leo? There we go. Take Leo out. I also added a little bandana to each of these guys. I think they look pretty boss. Turned out better than I thought. And uh, we'll grab Donnie. If that works. I got all this stuff off. There you go. And we're going to take Donnie, who is loaded up with stuff, and we're going to go down to the water's edge, and we are going to begin a construction project. Um, I want to make a taming pen. Now, people all over this island have those. It's basically a big space where you can grab a dinosaur or lure it in there. Um, most people use a flyer, pick it up, drop it in. And then you have a contained area in which to tame your dinosaur. You have windows, you can shoot it through with trank darts and whatnot. And um, I would like to have one of those on the back of a raft. So with that in mind, I have loaded Donnie up. As you can tell, he's, he's hurting. He's also, of all these guys, they've all been leveled up for carry weight. Primarily, he is struggling. But he's the newest, and I've been talking about him for a couple episodes. So I wanted to show him off to you. So he's got everything he needs. Now, this isn't a promise, but my my humble plan is to start, maybe, with this guy. This is the new Dire Bear. It's a fairly low-level one. Assuming he's still stuck there when we're done, I can free him and then show you the... Uh, the technique that I'm hoping to use on this mobile taming pen. Uh, so why don't I just go ahead and get started. I'm not sure how uh, good I'm going to be at building on camera. We will almost definitely take quite a few breaks along the way uh, for me to get the, the heavy duty stuff done. Uh, but let's head over to this water side, place the raft, and this is the, the very first step. There you go. So I think what we're going to do, disable the sail, which is an option there. And then um, I'm going to throw on uh, nine stone foundations. I'm going to do uh, the wooden fence foundations around all of the 12 edges. And then we're going to start putting up walls. Um, so why don't I get those, those beginning stages done and I will come back to you guys. And there we go. So nine foundations, 12 fence foundations all around the outside. And um, this is the back of the raft we're looking at right now. I know it's hard to tell at this current point, but I'm going to keep that in mind. I think what I want for the front of the raft uh, is ramps. So I'd like a, at least a two high wall and ramps that lead up the front of it so that I can drive this thing right into shore like a landing craft. And then I can come by with one of my flyers and get a, you know, for example, a bear to chase me. It'll chase me up the ramp, fall in here done right so this is the front it's gonna have a ramp so one of either the sides or the back needs a giant dino gateway um, and I think that's why I put the foundations down first I can't remember I came up with the plans for this raft a lot longer ago than I'm building them but I think this should lock right into place somewhere yeah let's do it on the side I think I think the side might be the key uh, yeah you know what? Let's back it up one. Let's do that. Right? Okay. Cool. And throw some doors in there. Perfect. And this is how we're going to get in and get out. And I could always add another ramp down there, I'm guessing. Um, and now I'm going to start throwing in some walls. What I wouldn't mind is sort of a safe area. So I'm thinking a two wide section of taming pen, and then a one wide sort of balcony on the outside. Um, and that one wide balcony is where we'll stand. We'll shoot through windowed walls, which I should have a few of. Yes, I do. Take these. Take these. You know what? I can probably start loading myself up. I can't remember why I've brought the pillars. 
What are the other fence foundations? Hmm. I know why the ladders are there. Ladders for getting in and out of the pen. Uh, oh, I know. The pillars are for making... Maybe I was going to make my... my. I'll just take it all. We'll figure it out as we go. <laughs> so let's start with the windowed and the regular walls. And we'll find spots for doors uh, as we move on. I know what the plan was. I was going to try and make a little safe driver's cabin. So that it was possible to drive while you had a bear in here. But I feel like that's probably a stupid idea. So let's just scrap that while we while we're thinking straight so we'll throw down a few of these uh and then off to the left here uh, let's try too high at first off to the left here off this wall is where we're gonna do the ramp whoops why don't you guys line up i think you messed up you messed up too you lined up to the gateway okay well let's see if we can keep that train going I'll just try and lock into that wall instead of anything else. Yes, there. Okay, cool. So I guess that's how we're doing it. Uh, and then this is where we throw in windowed walls. So you go right across here. Whoops. I guess we're doing them that way. I'm fine with it. I like mixing up the textures in this game. Uh, we'll put one here. And I don't think I'll need a whole lot more than that. But you know what? Maybe we could make a second level just in case we have something really big in here and we need multiple multiple trank dart shooters. So I'll put a second level up here. And maybe we'll throw door frame over here. That seems like the wise bet. Oh, that's not my guy. Okay, I was wondering who was wandering down by the beach here. Uh, we'll throw one of these right there. Sweet. Um... I'm not sure why I have two more of those, though maybe those were for that driver's pen thing I was talking about. So either way, we're, we're going to have a uh, uh, ramp off the front, nothing too fancy off the back. So let's start placing those. All right. And I have one more, which I need more than one more. I see. I wonder why I put those door frames. Why don't I just throw another door frame up there? It can't hurt. <clears throat> and do a wall here. And I'll craft one real quick. Can I craft one real quick? No. So I'm going to do the lazy man's thing. I have a door frame in inventory. We're going to throw it up there. I'll put a door in there. Done. <clears throat> Like I said, lazy man. Uh, and doors. Did I bring those? Yes, I did. But not enough for all these doorways. Weird. That's okay. So we'll put one there. We'll put one there. And I'll make another one for up there at some point. Uh, now my next step is to go ahead and get this loaded up with all the ramps and stuff, guys. So that this can actually be an effective pen so what i'm thinking i'll drive it up ram it into the shore ramps up the front of it here you kind of kite the creature with your pteranodon it chases you up the ramp falls in here and you trank it through here just ch -ch uh, so that's the plan let me throw some ramps on it and we'll go from there all right guys i think it's done i have never made one of these nor do i know how well it's gonna go but uh well, I'll give you the tour. So this is how you get the eventually tamed animal out of there. Uh, let's close these gates behind us. A uh, little door here out to the shooting gallery uh, right out here. So you can pick these guys off. And then just in case you do need to load up on people to take something down, uh, eventually you're supposed to be able to get the climb up option on that. Yeah, that's not working. I think I placed that ladder wrong. Yeah, that's not, not going to work. It's under the thing, not on the edge of the thing. Okay, we'll try on this side. Uh, so I'll hop up here. Throw a quick ladder up here. And then up here, you've got a really good view of everything. You can keep an eye on it. You can have extra supplies. In fact, I'm going to put a bed up on this ledge up here. So we'll do that. And then on the back, you get the giant ramp. Uh, it dips 
just about into the water. So I think for anything that we're going to try and kite from land, it should work. And my rough plan is to grab my pteranodon, uh, squishy, take off until I see a bear. I've decided this one over here, wherever he is, is too close to my other dinosaurs and I don't want to put them all on passive and then leave. That feels like a bad idea once I've got the bear in the boat. So I'm loaded up with my rifle with some trank darts. Uh, I'm going to grab squishy, Lord squishy, and we're going to set off until I've found a, uh, oh, it's getting dark fast. Eh? Uh, I'm going to set off until I have found some uh, good land or a good beast for us to attempt to, t uh, to tame in that boat. I, uh, I lied guys. We're not done. Uh, it's long been on my to-build list to make a pirate ship until I do. I'm painting this one all up in black and white. I don't have white. This is parchment, but hopefully it'll do. I am going to slap a coat of paint real fast. Nothing too fancy, nothing too detail-oriented onto this uh, raft. And uh, I'm going to come back with you guys when I'm done. Hey, why is that not done? That doesn't look very good. That's all right. I got to wait for daylight. Uh, let me slap a coat of paint and then we'll go find that bear. I'm liking it, guys. It is pretty good. There are usually a ton of bears over here on my left. Uh, so let's... I can't steer and look at the same time just because of the size of the raft. Yes, bears galore. Okay, perfect. I say we park one, park the raft, put it right up against the shore, boom. Now, let's go have a look at that. Hop out. Let's go have a look at the rampability of that. That's totally rampable. You get him to chase you up here, he falls in just like that, done deal. Okay, this is what I'm hoping for. Let's grab Squishy. We'll see if we can't kite one of these fools. Now, this is probably a fool's errand. Uh, I got a Pteranodon killed by a dire bear recently. So I'm going to try and pick the smallest and easiest dire bear. What are you? Level 16. I like it. Okay. Oh, yeah, wait. But you got a friend. You get a couple of friends. A couple of furry buddies over here. All right, let's go take a look at his friend over there. 16, and a male. Okay. I say we get the male. He's right there. Ready? Get packed, fool. Oh, yeah? Come get me. Come get me. Is he coming? Yes, he is. He's coming. Right up the ramp. No? Okay. Little server leg. Uh, not sure what happened on that one. Are you still pissed? He's still pissed. Okay, okay, come get me, idiot. Wow, he's having trouble. Okay, I shouldn't have picked such a heavily treed-in area. That dude is having a fit. Okay, he seems to have calmed down. Maybe I could get his buddy here. Get packed. Okay, now I go. Are you pissed? Are you angry at me? Nope. You're still cool. Cool as a cucumber bear. Okay. Ready? Okay. Okay. I got one angry at me. Okay, now I just need to get it up this ramp and into the raft. Easier said than done. Where is it? Where is it? Did I not aggro it? This is hard with all this. These trees around here. I was... Look at... God, they look... Okay. Okay, move. Is he mad? Yes, he's mad. Okay. Okay, move. Move, move, move. Oh, I see. He only chases when I'm really low and close to the ground. That means I gotta take out some of these trees. Okay, he's hitting me again. Okay. Well, this is why I said no promises at the start of the episode. Flashback to that right now. Now, this isn't a promise, but... Okay, come here, big guy. Come on up. 
Come on. Come on. What are you looking at? Stop getting stuck on my raft. You big beefy bastard. Okay. Well, go for a swim. Okay. I've got one successfully angry at me. And free. No. Is it stuck again? Okay. Chase me. Chase me, fool. Okay. Oh, oh. Oh. Oh, my bird is beat up. My bird is beat the hell up. Okay, I'm gonna go get my Argentavis, and we're gonna try this 2.0. You remember me, you furry fool? Do you? Do you remember me? Yes, you do. Okay. Come on. Up a ramp. Up a ramp. Up a ramp. Up a ramp. Come get me. Yes. Oh. My. Gosh, I actually did it. Yaus. Amazing. Can I park you here still? I can. And you're gonna be fine. Oh no. Okay. Be on peaceful. Be on peaceful mode. Okay. There you go. Hey. Okay. We gotta get to work, guys. We gotta get to work tranking this fool. Alright. Ready? He's gonna break out. I should have built this out of stone. Oh, his friend's helping. Oh, yeah? You're helping? I should open the door for you, too. I know they're lovers. Yeah, stop breaking stuff. Thank you. I feel much better knowing that this thing isn't getting trashed right now. I would love to aim for the head, but it won't give me a clear shot at his head, so I just gotta keep planting darts in his big furry butt. Boom. Get tired. Are you not tired yet? You are just speckled with trank darts right now. See, I'm gonna have to drive this thing out to sea or risk it being destroyed. Oh, is my bird being... No, my bird's fine. Pass out! You are... You are just... You won't give up. I only brought 75 darts. Get tranked, fool. Go down. Yes. Okay. Now, now is where you do the thing where you have the bird follow you, right? And then, if you're quick, you get under your raft before the bear notices, and you back up. Uh, or you, you take it out to sea. Here you go. See you later. Try and rescue your friend, you stupid bear. This is what you get for being a stupid bear. Aha! Okay. Is my bird following? Yes, he is. Beautiful. Life is good. Okay. So, I'm gonna go get some uh, narcotics, and I guess I'm gonna tame this thing up, and maybe I'll show you only when I'm riding it, because this will be a longer episode already with the raft construction. So, I will come back to you guys if I successfully tame it. Either way, it's a perfect test of the raft. We made it work. We got a bear in here, and now I will attempt to make the most of it. <laughs> There he is, so cute. Isn't he adorable? Okay, I have to go in via the traditional way. Oh yeah, okay. I haven't got a good way to get up here when it's in the ocean, to be totally honest with you. Uh, so let's load him up with meat. I didn't grab any prime, I guess. No, I'm gonna hold on to that cooked prime. That's my food, fool. You're just a low level bear. You ain't getting my prime meat. Oh, we are so getting there. <clears throat> that is close. That is very close. My patience, by the way, if you guys want to set aside some time to tame a dire bear, set some time. Uh, so far, he has taken quite a long while. I'm just going to narcotic him up. Uh, she. Sorry, I should keep saying she. I cannot wait. I've gone ahead and made a saddle. Did it up in shades of green and gold, which I think are going to look boss on this... Uh, this lady dire bear, and as soon as she is up, 
I'm taking her off. I mean, the sun just set, but by the time she's up, it should be dawn. I'm taking her, and we are going for a dawn patrol of the island. I can't wait to hop on the back of this beast and see just what sort of power even a low-level one has. My brief experience with them, killing uh, Zero Three, uh, it taught me to respect their power. Uh, and I honestly, I can't wait to hop on the back of this beast. I'm pretty stoked. I'm almost as stoked as when I tamed my first raptor ever. I don't know why. Something about riding a bear will make me feel like a king. Uh, it's, it's just something a man shouldn't be able to do. And I will get to. Uh, stay tuned and let me finish this beast up and I will come back with you guys. Oh, yes, you have tamed a wild dire bear. Hell yes. Okay, let's saddle you. Uh, honey. Oh, nope. We'll just call her honey for now. Uh, oh. I forgot, I'm on a server. Gotta let people know whose dinosaur, whose bear she is. Let people know who to fear. All right, all right, and ba-boom, and it's done. I've repositioned. We have a long, open stretch of beach ahead of us. Are you ready for this, beast? Beast, come here. Yes, look at it, look at it. Beautiful, all right, doors closed, you are about to be ridden like the true king you are. Yes! I love it! Oh, yes! Oh, we're picking up speed! Oh, yes! We are flying now! They got a full-on charge. Oh, my lord. Okay, what's up here? Let's kill a parrot. Let's kill a Dilophosaur. Dude, you are so about to get wrecked. Get smashed. Get smashed. Oh, yes. With ease. Level 100? I don't think so. Um, let's wait. I am just a level 16. Let's kill. Let's kill you. Yes. Oh, that didn't take long. Two swipes. Dead. Oh, my. Oh, my. Yes. Oh, okay. Let's get. Yes. You want to take on something that can bite back? Something that can destroy you? Get smashed, you trike idiot. I'ma destroy ya. I'ma just smack ya silly. Yes, die. Die at the hands of my mighty bear. Alright, let's pick up speed and let's charge this thing all the way across our mighty island. Oh, this is the best thing I have tamed in a long time. We are flying! Absolutely flying. This is magnificent. Past the barn down towards the beach. Jump? No, there's no jump. Fair enough. I wouldn't want to jump from that hill at that speed either. Oh yes, we are absolutely tearing it up. Hey, let's go hey, oh, until, until we hit a tree. It's cool. I gotta clear this section of beach out. If I'm gonna be doing donuts with my bear, I'm gonna need some space. Alright. Here we go. Building up speed now. We need to race bears. I'm not joking. Bears need to be raced. Look at this. Look at the speed you can generate on the back of this mighty, mighty beast. Yes! Alright guys, that is gonna do it. Take a poop. You've earned your poop. You have earned your poop. Honey. Honey girl. Honey bear. Uh, today we built that mobile taming pen. Uh, built it up with ramps to kite an animal into it we managed to do so we painted it up in shades of black and white because i don't yet have my pirate ship and uh we used that to tame this bear this is honey and together we are going to conquer the world what a great episode geeks thank you so much for tuning in my name is unite the clans and i will see all y'all in the next episode